Alright, what's happening guys? It's Karas here. I am finally getting to play this game. Um, this video will be uploaded from the stream, so... Some of the footage will be live spoken. But it's my first time. Um, wanted to jump on this game for a while. I actually bought it a few weeks ago. Um, as to uploading this video, I just haven't jumped onto it yet. So we're just going to get onto it now and have a look at what it's about. I like the idea of it being... Hmm. Hardened. All right, let's jump straight into it. Even back then, their tech was way ahead of what was coming out of America. We bought everything they could sell, from phones to tablets to just about anything. And when they started making weapons, well, we couldn't resist. Our wars in the Middle East had been getting worse and worse, one leading straight to the next. Even after that terrible day in Riyadh, we kept fighting as our country fell apart. And still, we bought Apex to give us an edge. As the dollar tanked, our debt to North Korea spiraled. Unemployment rocketed, and the country was on its knees. The failing government defaulted on the debt, and the North Koreans made their decision. Every piece of technology they'd sold us had a back door. They turned off our military with a single button press. The first KPA troops on U.S. soil were said to be there to rebuild. But after the early aid packages, there was only brutality. They stole our liberty and our freedom. America is under control of the KPA. But she will rise again. You are the revolution. It's quite a good intro to be honest, it's a nice bit of a backstory. Hello and welcome to KAC, I'm Su Bing Kang. Today's top story, preparations begin today for the much anticipated Patriots Day Parade. This auspicious calendar event celebrates the contribution of the liaison officers who work tirelessly to bridge the gap between the emergency administration and the ordinary citizens. To ensure the safety of the citizens during the parade, Mayor Simpson has vowed to redouble anti-terrorist efforts and has allocated additional peacekeeper resources to tackle any and all criminal activity in the lead up to the parade. Mayor Simpson has just released the following statement. We all know only too well the threats we face daily here in Philadelphia. The bombings, the shootings, all orchestrated by Benjamin Walker's national network of terror. Rest assured, we will bring these criminals to justice. Peacekeeper patrols keep our streets safe and secure for all citizens. Thanks to improved threat recognition systems in our drones, potential off, terrorists Brady. can be identified and neutralized swiftly. fucking guy. He calls us terrorists after what he's done? He wouldn't be so confident if he knew Walker was right here in Philly. Yeah, Walker's really gonna stir things up. How long till he's due? Five minutes. Hope one of those new drones doesn't scan him. Are we ready? I think so. Fucking hope so. <laughs> Something, eh, Brady? Only been, what, uh, three days with us? And you're gonna meet Walker in person? He's the whole reason I'm here. He's inspired all of us. Brady, can you pass me some gas? Thanks. I guess Walker was a legend in Washington, too, huh? I heard a little about what happened there. I'm sorry. I'm glad you're here with us hey now. Hey, guys, there's something weird. 
The street's deserted. What? Shit, is it us? Fuck, Walker's gonna be here any minute. It's a Out! Get out! Tell him nothing, Brady. You hear? Hello. Thank you for waiting so patiently. We can get started now. So, you are gonna tell me where I can find Benjamin Walker. You're wasting your time here. The last thing I heard, Walker was down in Memphis. You know I have superpowers. Fuck your powers, you pathetic little traitor. Oh, sounds like someone needs a demonstration. I'll show you exactly how powerful I am. I take my hand like this. I point. Barry. And... Do it, you son of a bitch! No! 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 Ain't that something? So, how about it? Are you ready to talk now? Start talking. I won't go so easy on you. It's Walker. Wait, wait. Fuck you. Seems to be a heavy amount of aggression in this game, quite like it. Give me a gun. Let's go. Say it seems like quite a long intro for a game. Oh, that's right, we've had longer. This is the place. We should be safe here for now, but the Norks will tear the district apart looking for us. We've got to make contact with another resistance cell. Fuck, I picked a bad time to get shot. Remember these? This phone is our ticket to safety, if you can find a network transceiver and hack into it. That'll connect us to the hidden resistance signal and show us the closest safe house. Here, take it. Working blind here. You need to find a resistance stash. That should have intel on the district, including transceiver locations. But hurry, Brady, we don't have long. Just have a quick look around, see what uh, we can pick up. Good. Just no 
another day for you. That was me. I kind of, uh, I really like the idea of it actually, the sort of, the way you can climb and go around things quite easily, it's quite fluid, um, it moves quite smoothly which is nice.
Okay, I really like this element. They've really gone to town with sort of how they hide the resistance. Wow, you really have to climb and crawl and duck. It's quite, it's quite good. It's interesting. A lot of games would have had that a lot shorter and easier. Just sort of bang, you drop down a hole, you walk through a tube. But that makes more sense. You've got to think of the reality of it. You know, if this was real, you'd want it very hard and unobvious, especially if you're hiding. I saw it. Where are you going, huh? Fucking spy, fucking traitor, trying to sell us out to the Norks for a handful of rice, yeah? Let's teach him a lesson. I'll go first. Easy, Bakes. Dana said we caught anyone, we gotta tell her first. You don't wanna piss her off, do you? Well, I just hope she leaves a piece for me. I wouldn't count on it. I don't think I'll be seeing you again. Heavy fuck, huh? Be a bit lighter once Dana's finished with him. Yeah. <laughs> down there I'm Dana and you are Mr. Spy you and I we're gonna play a game you're gonna tell me what the Norks know about us and I'm gonna hurt you while you do it this game will be a lot more fun for me than you I'm afraid the question is a shit ton of mascara as per usual Crazy chick got a knife. We'll become friends. Just scream as loud as you want, okay? No need to suffer in silence. Okay. Nipples first. <laughs> hey Dana, here we got company. Who is he? Oh, uh, just another spy. I'm asking a few questions. How do you know he's a spy? Well, that's what Baker and Skazari said. Those two? Dana, they're dumb as shit. Do you got anything on him? Say, pal. That's some ID. What you got here? Ethan Brady. I knew it. Walker's message said he was coming in with this guy. Well, no one told me. Yeah, well, if I could ever find you when I need you. Mm. You'd only just joined Harvey's crew, right? I'm sorry about what happened, but you survived. We could use a guy like you. I'm Jack Paris, by the way. This is Doc Sam Burnett, and, uh... Ain't no more you met, no hard feelings, I hope. You're a lucky boy. You okay, kid? Looks like some head trauma. Possible concussion. I got some pills you should take. Hey, Doc, you don't need to open up. He needs to keep his focus. Head injuries can be unpredictable. You feeling confused, kid? Disconnected? He's fine, Doc. You know what's real, don't you, Brady? Looks like he's been through a lot. Last thing he needs is more trouble. Can't you fix him up a new ID and let him go? It's not that easy, Doc. You saw the screens. The Norks want this guy bad. Besides, we need people like him. Ain't afraid to take a chance. We've seen too much already. Yeah. So, what do you say, Brady? You gonna stick with us, huh? It ain't gonna be glamorous. And you're probably gonna die. Ah, speeches like that. I'm amazed we haven't won the war already. Yeah, well, that's why we need Walker. Our words ain't my special. So, any objections to Brady joining us? Yeah. No? Sweet. Well, if no one's gonna listen to me, I'll be getting back to my work. Good luck, kid. Go along, Doc. All right. As soon as we get word where they're holding Walker, we gotta find a way to bust them out. Everything depends on them. But first things first, we're gonna get you trained up and show you how we do things around here. I'm heading out. Got that transceiver to take care of. See ya. Walker. Well, it's good you came along with me. Instincts tell me you're all right. 
We need more people like you. People willing to join the uprising. Now, that's what it's all about now. We gotta stir the people up, and soon enough we'll be snowballing. Get the whole city behind us, and the Norks won't stand a chance. Walker's a spark. People will follow him. We gotta get him back. Uh, we've been down here for a few months now. This is all part of the Broad Street subway extension. It was mothballed back in 21 when the city ran out of money. It's not on any of the pre-war maps, so the Norks don't know about it. And here you have it, Brady. This is the boot that's gonna kick the KPA's ass. Come on over here. But well, first things first, let's get some American steel in your hands. This is, uh, Sidney Cook. He runs the armory. You look to run Who's the this? Fighter. That's Ethan Brady. He was helping Walker. Walker got arrested. Yeah, but that wasn't Brady's fault. Don't worry about Cookie here. He's, uh, generally in a pissed-off mood. But he's a genius in improvising weapons, and that's why we keep him around. Ain't that right, Cookie? Always cooking up something new. <laughs> One day you're gonna make that joke and I'll shoot you dead. Then we'll see who's laughing, huh? Sidney, take it easy, will you? Brady needs a weapon. What can you spare? Come on. MP5 with a red dot scope, please. This. If it turns out you show some aptitude, then we can talk about upgrading. I know you're thinking a pistol won't do much. But with one of Cookie's special conversion kits, suddenly you got yourself an SMG. Come on, Brady, grab yourself a kit. Don't be shy, Brady, take a kit. There you go. Now try converting your pistol. Always a charmer. See you around, Sid. Parrish, we're still waiting on that transceiver intel. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. Don't worry about it. More's on it. Say hey to Brady here. He's a new recruit. Resistance is more than just frontline troops. What's up? It's people helping the best they can. Take Doc Burnett. He's a good example. It's not gonna win this war, though. Top line is, we gotta build up our strength by expanding our red zone operations. We keep ambushing and raiding. That weakens the Norks and strengthens us. Eventually, we'll turn the tables. And in the yellow zones, we're fighting for the hearts and minds of the people trapped there. We give them the belief that we can win. And when Walker gives the call, they'll rise up and follow. We only get one shot, though. We gotta be ready. Okay, I want you to head to the red zone. Dana will teach you how we operate. Out there, she's the best in the business. Just try not to piss her off, huh? Show me I'm right to trust you, okay? Plan to win? You don't want to go out there unprepared. You should take some Molotovs. Hey, Lorna, help the new guy out. Be best if you learn how to make your own. Grab some ingredients and give it a try. Okay, now let's put it all together. Try making one. There you go, nice one. Okay, now you're set. Molotovs are great against their soldiers, but they don't do shit to drones or vehicles, so watch out for those. Elm trees down here. Good luck out there. So far, so good. I actually really, really like it. Um, it moves really fluid. That's my main thing. I like the high, the high FPS, the moves fluid, the crouching. Uh, I'm really going to enjoy this, I think. So that was the first 28 minutes, guys. I'm going to do a few more minutes on this video, and then we're going to switch over to part two.
Dana, this is Parrish. I'm sending you Brady. He can help you hit the KPA transceiver. Make sure you get the coordinates of every KPA operation in the area. Dana here. Understood. We'll get you those locations. As soon as we can reach the KPA transceiver, we'll download the data. Shit, Dana. We got a patrol. They must have switched rooms overnight. You got any ideas? No time to go around. Let's hit him. Brady! Okay. Over here. Parrish wants you trained, and I guess I owe you for before, so you get to learn from the best. Just try not to screw things up. New plan. We're ambushing this patrol. Brady, best if you go with G-Man. Just do what he says. Try not to die. Come on, buddy, this way. And yeah, try not to die. Alpha, you got anything? Yeah. Give me a second. Okay, yeah, Dana, there's barrel traps on Elm Tree Avenue just ahead. You coming with me? All right, stay close. Watch yourself on this rubble, it's pretty unstable. And keep your head down when we get up there. Move slow and smooth. I think we're clear of snipers, but it doesn't hurt to be cautious. This is the barrel trap. You can work it. Damn things make me nervous. When they pass underneath, that left. Ready on the barrels. Not yet. Wait. Now! I didn't like that, jeez, you could see my aiming was a bit shit just then. My aiming was really bad. I'm used to aim assist, so it's usually a bit lighter on the like control. But that's alright. I just have to get used to it.
Brady, it's more. You managed to get to the transceiver. I'm impressed. We'll put that intel to good use. I guess Parrish was right about you. I'm gonna Jeez, they got my boots. You should familiarize yourself with our operation. We have our main weapons store hidden inside this district. It's run by Ned Sharp. You should head over there. Introduce yourself. I'm uploading the location to your phone now. I'll see you around, Brady. This is Philly Alpha, all available teams, listen up. We want Walker. We're gonna get him back. Bet your ass we are. I want everybody's eyes and ears wide open. Any word, any sign, any sub-micro speck of information about where they've taken him, you report in. Everybody got that? Loud and clear. On it. You got it. Alpha, where you at? Supply run in Elm Tree for Ned. You got something? Parish wants all available teams on walk and set. Top priority. I hear you. As soon as we nail the supply truck, garage used to fix up a lot of our vehicles during the early days. After the Battle of Philly, the KPA turned it into a stronghold. Take it back.
establishing a new base of operations within the Elm Tree Dry Dock. Liberating this from the Norks will give us a great way to smuggle supplies in the zone. Warehouse. We cannot allow the Norks to listen in on our communications or let them pinpoint where we're storing our munitions. Get in there and take it out. Taking out that listening pulse will prevent the KPA from pinpointing our locations within the zone and make our movements harder to track. Nicely done. Andy, this is Philly Alpha. Come in. Has anybody heard from those guys? Nothing here. That's team? Last I heard, they were in Elm Tree. Fuck, aren't they responding?
Bunch of assaults trapped inside. Nearby, they need help fast. Seems to be a bit of a bug there, I can't get into that house, no way. see anything obvious. Helen says there's no trace site. there. We need more coverage. Rat Pack, please What's respond. It's all going a bit topsy-turvy. I think it's stuck on that mission, but it won't Basically, I can't kill them, it's kind of bugged, it's kind of shit. 
so it won't allow me to progress. But that's all right. That's about all we have time for. We have that's the first hour of uh, Homefront Revolution. Thanks for tuning in. I shall be putting up a part two very shortly. And yeah, stay tuned. Thanks, guys. <laughs>